It's a dangerous game being homeless on the streets of Los Angeles. Former construction worker Carlos Gonzalez has been sleeping rough for the past two years and has seen friends die. People dying like left and right, either overdose, they get stabbed, they get shot, or argument leads to a killing. The Los Angeles County Department of Public Health says the number of homeless deaths have doubled during the pandemic and the vast majority are male. Carlos is now worried that if he doesn't get off the street soon, he might be next. It's tough being homeless because it's dangerous. You know, you, you got to sleep with one eye open and then you have to deal with the rats and stuff. You're afraid of somebody coming by and stabbing you or lighting you on fire or something. Drug overdoses driven by the easy availability of opioids are the leading cause of death among those living on the streets. Tracy Johnson, who runs a charity feeding the homeless, says it's shocking that many young people are also dying simply from hypothermia. Eric was 38 and been homeless. He died from hypothermia, just being too cold out on the street with no covers. The destitute population in LA has more than doubled in the past seven years, making it the homeless capital of the United States during the pandemic. Yes, the pandemic uh, caused people to fall into hard times, perhaps lose their source of financial stability, and it spiraled, as it does, into being unhoused, which then led to turning perhaps to some sort of coping mechanism of drugs and other things. And it looks like it will only get worse as housing costs in California continue to skyrocket while the state's health care services are being stretched to the limit with much of the focus on still fighting COVID-19. Martin Markovitz, TRT World, Los Angeles, California.